Welcome back to Half-Life, everyone. I am rested, back from vacation, and still not ready to deal with this giant thing that wants to eat me. He is awfully cool, though. He's not quite, not quite the tentacle monster, like I said before, but still pretty cool. So... Let's go see if we can take care of him. Okay, lucky M4. Set. Shotgun is ready in case anything j tries to jump me at close range here. And I think we're about as ready as we're ever gonna be. So let's go see what we can do. Oh! Oh, I see you hiding. <laughs> vort? What vort? I don't see any vort there. <laughs> oh, I was hoping that would be an alternate way around, but I guess not. They really do want us to deal with this thing. Okay. Oh, I really don't want to do this. Well, time to f fix our courage to the sticking place and charge. Uh, where? Oh, shit, 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 shit! It's gonna end again! Oh, fuck. Ka Please let this be the way. Please let this be the right way. Oh my god, he can get in here. Oh shit. Uh, safe. Okay, this has to be safe, right? There's a button there. Ah, oh, crap! Duh! Wow. That... That killed him. I was fully expecting that to open some kind of a door somewhere or something, but... He died. Hey, I'll take it. I, I wasn't looking forward to fighting him. And he was a lot meaner and nastier than the, uh... Tentacles, I think. Or at least he wasn't as cute. Wow. That... That was surprising. Yeah, because what I really need after fighting this thing is a grenade. How about a health pack? No, actually it's not that big deal. I'm not that badly damaged and... I'll give Valve this. If there is one thing that that Valve is, it is scrupulously fair. I don't think I have ever run into a situation in this game yet that I wasn't uh, warned about beforehand or that they didn't illustrate. Hmm. This is a bit of a puzzle. Oh, did that just... Oh, third rail. Oh, smart little buggers. Valve is. Hmm, but if it's electrified, that means that this probably works. Ah, oh, ha ha, it does work. solution to this would be anywhere, I assume it would be the track controls. Don't know 
why, but there must be something here. Including the supercharge, I forgot about that. Aha! That's what I'm talking about. Excellent. Let's get back there. Doo -doo. All right. Fantastic. problem. <sighs> this is the wrong door. Sorry. Backtrack. Okay. Back to the control room again. I can't remember. I must have pulled that in the last episode and you weren't supposed to. Supposed to drive the thing onto it before you pull it. Oh well. Didn't take up that much time. Actually, kind of a nice. There we go. Kind of a nice break. After a. After a lot of fighting, man, between the Marines and that big, scary, one eyed fire shooting dude. Take a little bit of boring backtracking and button pulling. Or lever pulling, rather. Now. Oh, I see. That's how we're gonna get through here. Okay. Time to pull a Ben Hur and ramming speed. Well, ramming speed is apparently still only like five miles an hour, and those were empty cardboard boxes. But whatever. Anticlimactic, but it worked. Ooh, hey there! It's Barney. Yeah, I did. I did finally look up Barney's Freeman, name. I've been waiting for you. One of your scientist pals said to give you a message. You're supposed to take this old rail system up to some kind of satellite delivery rocket. I don't what? know where it is exactly, and the old guy was so worried about getting out of here alive, he didn't tell me. Well, then you guys is, are the useless, aren't you? Aborted the launch, so when you do find the rocket, you'll have to get up to the control room and launch it yourself. He said something about a Lambda team needing the satellite in orbit if they were ever going to clean up this mess. What the hell would a satellite do to help kill the Roger aliens? That. Run like hell. No. I'll stay here and guard this area. Yeah, it's a good plan. No, seriously, what? Unless it's a satellite that's got a super laser that's going to explode this entire facility, there is nothing a satellite could do to possibly help. I mean, I'll accept it as a MacGuffin because this is an awesome game, but it's still a stupid, stupid plan. Uh, uh, excuse me? Boy, am I glad I saved. I am so glad I just, like, hit that save button every three seconds. Because if I had had to redo a big portion of that running around, I would be so mad. Just be a little more careful this time, I guess. Okay. Hmm. You know what? Screw you guys. So many pistol bullets. I can afford to waste them on you. I hate barnacles. Hmm, so apparently this thing can float. And 
interesting. Well, actually, it looks like we're just about out of time, and I don't know where I'm going anyway, so we will call it quits here for now. And when we return, we will explore these flooded catacombs under the facility and attempt not to get electrocuted. So until then, I'll see you next time. Creepy music. Really cool creepy music, actually. Oh well, see you next time.